What is the Democratic National Convention? Well, it's a lot of things. It's parties, it's food, it's networking, it's concerts, it's, it's protesters, it's police. But the main event is happening right here at the Pepsi Center, right behind me in Denver. Democratic National Convention 2008 is about to begin. You can feel the energy in the air. All the major news outlets are here. BBC, CNN, ABC News, CBS News, Al Jazeera is here, C-SPAN, even Fox News is here at the Democratic National Convention, and of course, the Plum TV Network is here. We're covering it, and why don't we see what's going on? Take a look around. Are you a political? Are you, are you no, I'm, I'm, I'm pretty independent on that. And I vote my conscience and my mind at the time that I... Even if the truth hurts our side, we are going to tell the truth. Because our highest responsibility is to the truth. You know what? The people here are freakishly friendly, too. It's like, are you really being that nice to me? I mean, I live in New Jersey and work in New York, so... I just, whenever I see people imitating human beings, it kind of freaks me out. We're at the Denver Art Museum for Count Me In for Women's Economic Independence. It's a celebration of women entrepreneurs and of women's suffrage. And to, uh, to celebrate the whole thing in style, Hillary Clinton's going to be here to talk. And I hope we can count each and every one of you to be part of making our dreams come true and giving us back a president and a vice president who will stand with us to make sure we have more support for people across our country try to make their lives better for themselves and their families. Thank you all very much. We're at the conventions because Rock the Vote's mission is to engage young people in the political process. And conventions is the moment where all eyes are on politics. And we're able to insert young people into the debate and talk about the issues young people care about and make sure all those electeds and VIPs and media know what's going on at the youth vote are important. And this year of any year, people are psyched, they're engaged. This year, we are primed to make this the year of the young voter. If you don't like the news, go out and make some of your own. And that's what you guys are doing now. There's a lot of grassroots and uh, progressive liberals who are organizing and using the convention as an excuse to gather, and that's what I'm more interested in. Well, Headcount works with about 70 different musicians to help register voters. So what we generally do is we send volunteers to their concerts and set up voter registration tables, kind of classic concert-based organizing. We'll do it about a thousand times this year and register around 100,000 voters. We're here in front of the Denver Convention Center, another venue where lots of stuff is happening as part of the Democratic Convention. Everybody's outside, there's a lot of commotion, a lot of people clamoring to get in, including this guy right up here. I hope they lock their trash. I'm an Obama delegate from Oregon, and I wanted to uh, hear Hillary's uh, speech with, uh, you know, uh, specifically releasing her delegates, which she did, and, uh, and she said, I marked my ballot this morning for Barack Obama. So here's what just happened. All the states were cast in their votes. New Mexico passed its votes to Illinois, the home of Barack Obama. Illinois passed its votes to the state of New York, home of Hillary Clinton, and Hillary Clinton said, let's just stop this and nominate Barack Obama right now. And that's why we're playing the train.